Chrissy Beebe's Bedtime Story. Hello, you're watching CBeebe's Bedtime Stories with me, Rosie, and my husband, Chris. Hi there. So get yourself snuggled up for tonight's bedtime story. But wait, have you got your teddy, Chris? Uh, I certainly do, Rosie. You know I don't go anywhere without Mr Snuggly Wiggles. <laughs> Trust me, I know. <laughs> tonight's story is all about how Jelly started to feel very worried and that it's OK to feel all wobbly like Jelly sometimes because what's important is knowing how amazing you truly are. Yes, you. You are amazing. Isn't that right, Teddy? This story is called When Jelly Had a Wobble and is written by Michelle Robinson and illustrated by Tom Knight. Everyone was heading to the Kitchen Hall of Fame. Fresh or canned or frozen, everybody felt the same. Excited to be going where all dinners long to go, to sit at the top table as the very best in show. My friend got picked once, Orange pipped. Imagine, what a thrill! But Jelly had a wobble. Go ahead, I'm feeling ill. You'll miss the big announcement, Squirty Cream said. Come on, mate. We all deserve to be here, even Jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. Chicken nuggets, sausage rolls, falafel balls and more. All piled on in and wondered who the golden crown was for. Nervous Jelly tried to run. It's really not my thing. I'd rather put me gym jams on and have a nice night in. So Jelly found a quiet spot. He wasn't being rude. I just can't take the tension. Good luck, all you other food. Come on, Jelly, Cake said. You'll enjoy it, just you wait. Make way, everybody. Here comes Jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate. Wibble, wobble, wibble, wobble. Jelly on a plate. The crowded hall fell silent as the biscuit took the stage. Welcome, everybody, to a foodie golden age. <laughs> Tonight we crown a superstar, an all-time favourite food. He's pretty shy and quiet, but he's still a total dude. Jelly's belly did a flip. That person sounded ace. They'll never speak of me like that. The tears rolled down his face. I wibble in the middle and I wobble on the edge. I'm not at all nutritious like the other healthy fruit and veg. I'm silly and I'm frivolous. I've reached me cell by date. But Jelly's buddy Ice Cream said, Well, I still think you're great. It's true you're shy and quiet, but you're also sweet and kind. Come on, Jelly, sit with me. That is, if you don't mind. If you're still feeling wobbly, try to focus on the ceiling. Take a few deep breaths. You'll soon forget that nervous feeling. He felt a trifle better with a friend to sit beside. Whoever won, he'd cheer them on with heartfelt foodie pride. It did feel nice to be here and to share his fellow's fate. We proudly pass the golden crown to... Jelly on a plate! Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. Jelly sat there wobbling. Did they really call my name? Come on up and join us in the Kitchen Hall of Fame. You worry about everything, but that's because you care. We all get anxious sometimes. It's a feeling we all share. Yes, you wibble in the middle. Sure, you wobble on the edge. You've not a lot in common with the healthy fruit and veg. We know you think that's silly and it makes you feel quite small. But we all feel like that sometimes. Jelly represents us all! <laughs> well, Jelly had a wobble as he stood there looking down. But it felt quite good to wobble in a sparkly golden crown. And there he wobbles on, the sweetest food you ever ate. A much-loved party favourite. Good old Jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. <laughs> wow, what a wonderful story that was. Who would have thought that jelly won the competition in the end after all that worry? Oh, Chris, I love jelly. But while our food friends celebrate through the night, shall we get Teddy ready for bed? Yeah, come on, Teddy. We hope you enjoyed our wibbly-wobbly bedtime story and we'll see you again soon. Good night. Watch more on BBC iPlayer.